Hey, in this video, we're going to look at all of the different options that are out there that let you build your star guide online. So we're going to look at all of these brands and I'm going to show you how to use them. But by the way, here is my star guide in PDF. There's like 70 pages and I'm just going to rebuild that digitally by using some of these tools, right? Now, before we start looking at these tools, let's quickly talk about the benefits of an online star guide versus a PDF star guide. So obviously, is interactive you can update it anytime it's easy to browse you can provide great experience to whoever is working on your brand and you have a great governance over the document right so you can password protect that you don't have to worry about attachments you know pdf versions someone not being able to open the guideline or download the right logo files and stuff like that so let's look at the first option which is standards and doesn't mean that this is the best tool, but it's best for me. And I basically recreated my whole PDF by using this tool. And I'm going to show you how I did that. So when you land on this website, you're going to see a lot of examples right here. And it's used by some of the great agencies that I admire, like Pentagram or Gretel and brands like Zipline or Skillshare. And they also show you a lot of examples that I really liked. For example, SeedGeek. You can see what can be done by using this tool, right? Once you sign in, here is how the dashboard looks like. Here is my style guide. You can just go ahead, create a new project, type in your brand name, you can select an outline. You can start totally from scratch or you can use one of those outlines. Like this is very simple. It's just the logo, colors and, and basics. But I went with this one because it has more sections like strategy and so on. And by the way, you can choose the exact sections that you need. So I basically selected all of them. It's just I don't have the language section. I removed that later. You just answer those questions. You upload your logo. My logo is right here. Then you add colors so I'm just gonna add my primary color right here then you can upload your fonts or you can select your fonts later and so I'm gonna hit finish and basically what it does is it creates this structure for you which is really really great you have all these sections if you go to for example logo section right here you're gonna find out that your logo is already there and it automatically created those color versions although this is not good so we can change that later but it saves you a lot of time it creates these sections automatically you just upload the svg of your logo you can of course build everything the way you want but it automatically creates the don'ts section which i really like and the same with the colors right and typography if you go to the color section you automatically have this section basically created you can add more colors which i did and you can work on this but it saves you so much time here is my final version as you can see you can click all of these sections you can go there we have the strategy section here you can just go to the next section here and as you can see i've added more colors i've added some of my images like about the safe space and stuff like that but it helped me a lot and it saved me so much time so the process is quite automated right so here's my digital star guide and here is the one I built using InDesign. As you can see, it's very, very similar. So I was actually able to rebuild that PDF and it basically looks the same, right? So it's very consistent with what I already had. Okay, so the next on my list is BrandPad. And BrandPad is also used by some of the biggest agencies and brands out there. Here is a preview of NASA Star Guide, which is very comprehensive. And they have a lot of templates that you can use as a base for your Star Guide. Uh, you can just continue with that and keep customizing that so once you log in here is my draft you just start by creating a new project to input the name and then you can select some of those templates so i really like this one international or you can start from scratch so similar to standards this is how the interface looks like it's very minimalist so you can just add your phones here and you have this small sidebar here you just switch between library and presets and you build the star guide the way you want right so i can just click right here i can start you know 
changing the text. I can change the, the images and I can make some global changes to the colors. I can upload my logos and stuff like that. Next on my list is Frontify and it's also used by some of the biggest brands like Uber. And I also tried to use it to recreate my style guide online. So this is one of the biggest platforms to host your style guide. It goes well beyond your style guide and is trusted by some of the biggest brands like Uber, Lufthansa, Budweiser, Volkswagen, Microsoft, and Kia and many other brands. You can get a trial for 21 days. And once you log in, this is how it looks like. So you just create a new brand and you type in your name, you select your primary color, and then you just create a new style guide, right? And also you have three options. You can start from scratch. You can go with the basic style guide or more advanced. So I'm just gonna go with more advanced. So this is how the interface looks like. It doesn't automate much stuff for you, but it's all customizable. So you have to build each of those sections manually, basically. So you can upload your logo. You can create your logo variations and stuff like that. But you have lots of integrations and you have a great control over how your style guide looks like. And the next on my list is Corebook. And Corebook is also a great platform. And I also try to recreate my style guide, as you can see here. So when you land on the website, you're going to see some of the interface. They have some preview. And it's also used by some of the biggest brands like Tinder, Miro. We have Martini and also big agencies like VaynerMedia, Macan. It's got great options. So I'm not gonna go deep into that, but basically Frontify, Corebook, BrandPad, and Standards provide you with similar features. It's just about pricing and some of the functionality that you really want. Next on my list is Baseline, which is quite different. So it allows you to build a style guide, but also it's like Canvas. So once you build a style guide, you can also create like social media graphics that are on brand. I also try to recreate my style guide, as you can see here, and it does a pretty good job, but we're not going to go deep into that, but check links in the description and you can see some of the drafts I created. You can see some of the other examples. Now, the next one on my list is Branding Guide. Branding Guide is a very, very simple and free option to create your style guide. Basically, it's like a one page document with your logos and then you can download these brand assets. Very, very simple option. Then you have a Lingo app which is something in the middle. It's also being used by some of the biggest brands like Duolingo, Reddit, Snapchat. I also tried to recreate my star guide using this tool and it does a pretty good job. For example, you can upload your SVG. It automatically creates different files like PNGs, JPEGs. And so it also automates some of the process for you. Next is Ginger Sauce, which is a quite different solution. It, you go through a series of steps. And what it does is basically allows you to create a PDF just like that. And then you can browse that online or you can download that PDF. And as you can see, it's a draft. That's why it has a watermark. The next one is a similar option, which is Flip Snack. It also allows you to create a PDF online and then host that and browse that online. I just uploaded my own PDF and then you can just browse that online. Then you have Binder, which I don't have access to, but it's like a big platform mainly for like big corporations and they don't even have a free trial or anything like that. You have to schedule a demo. So it's like for big companies. And then the last option is a free solution. All designers basically have Adobe CC and it comes with InDesign and did you know that there is an option to actually publish that PDF online and so you can use for example my template which I have right here and I basically customize that template for each client so if you want to use this option you can check out my brand guidelines kit find link in the description and here are some of the examples as you can see I use the same template but it doesn't mean that it has to look the same it all looks consistent with their branding right so you can totally customize that template to your needs you can find all of these links in the description below and i hope it inspires you to create your own digital star guide and by the way check out my other video on how to create a star guide from scratch i will see you in the next video